Hey everybody, I'm the Maple Man. Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome back to part 12 of Meek's Nursery. What originally started as a seven toddler challenge uh, has now moved into its own gameplay. All the toddlers have aged up to children and none were taken away. In the last part, uh, Zane, sort of the, the one adult who's looking after all the kids, uh, took them out to the library and it went really well even though most of them slept outside on benches in a blizzard. But still, he didn't lose any of them. <laughs> Just a miracle in and of itself. In this part, uh, I'm hoping to take them out again to something a little bit more fun. Um, and I also want Zane to um, develop his relationships or build his relationships back up with his best friend and his girlfriend, who he has not seen in ages because of the Seven Toddler Challenge. Um, that kind of brings us up to speed, and that's where we're at. Um, I appreciate if you've been watching. I thank you very much for that. If you have any comments, questions, or anything you'd like to say, Feel free to leave them in the comment section. I do check them, and I do try to reply when I can. I think that's enough said. Peace and love, everybody. Now let's play. Yes, Zane. It was a rough night. Get your coffee. Start a new day. You're actually not in too bad a state, but the place is a disaster. Ghost Caden decided to start destroying things, and just about every one of the children had a monster um under their bed so they kept waking up zane um yeah so everyone's exhausted everyone's panicky the place is a disaster everyone's trying to get the last few minutes of sleep oh but it is saturday okay so i didn't realize that um yeah so um hmm, change of plans but that's okay um we're gonna take the kids to the beach yesterday they went, or in the last part, they went to uh, the library and they did really well there, except a lot of them wanted to sleep out in the snow. So now they can sleep out in uh, the hot, sunny weather. And hopefully none of them drown. But I am going to, I'll give it till 9. I'll try to get their needs up and get Zane working on a few things because uh, a lot of stuff is broken. We'll see what we get done by 9. And uh, we'll go from there. If anything's interesting, I will uh, keep it in the gameplay. Otherwise, might zip ahead till night, but Zane really needs his coffee, I know that. Oh yeah, and one of the things, now that I think about it, is I got rid of one of the bathrooms because I do want Zane to work on side jobs. Okay, something else broke or something went wrong there. Um, and uh, so I took away one of the washrooms so that Zane could have a little office here. Um, so now they're down to one washroom. I don't know why I did that to myself, but you know what? That's the way it is. And are pretty somebody wet themselves. That's why Rock is that Roxana? Why Roxana's in the bath? Someone really needs to go to the wash my Yeah, it was probably her. Oh, so does she. Oh well, we're gonna have some uh wet children. Might just have to put some outhouses out back or something. Okay, so it is their beach day. It doesn't look that sunny. Oh apparently someone stinks. I think it's Yvonne, but that's okay. I think what we're going to do is, I do want Zane to do some swimming, but I think he'll grill up some hot dogs for everybody. I think somebody is, um, where are hot dogs? Hot dogs. He's going to grill up hot dogs for everybody so that at least there's food there. Um, there's little, there's towels and, um, uh, uh, beach furniture that they can sleep on. I'm going to keep an eye on the ones that are swimming because that could be dangerous. But there's there's a lot of stuff they can do here. Uh, Roxana is doing nothing. What is wrong, Roxana? She's just, she's sad. From her gloomy trait. Other than that, she's um, feeling happy because she's remembering the good old days of being a toddler. And Bill... Bill just won't stop talking to Zane. He's just a chatterbox. Somehow, some when they bonded. So I just want to make sure that... Okay. <laughs> okay, keep an eye on everybody. I just want to make sure that if anybody's swimming, they're okay. No, nope, everybody's sleeping. That's great. Even Gulliver. At least Gulliver... Uh, got out onto uh, this floating thing to go to sleep and not drown in the water. Caden, 
Hey, I heard you became friends with Zane Meek. He's pretty cool. Why are you calling Gulliver? Actually, Zane, you need your friends to come over. Yeah, Bill is just like attached to Zane at the hip. I don't know why. Oh, he's even Zane. Does Zane stink? Oh, yeah, his hygiene's bad. I do want him to go swimming, but I want him to call over Ebony and... There's Ebony and Caden. Where is Caden? Oh, he's in his policeman uniform. Oh, he, he's probably working. But let's see. That's right, we made him a detective in uh, the Never Ending Party, so... That's fine. Okay, these don't need to be on the ground. We put those there. Maybe you should call everyone to meal so that everyone gets something to eat. Is someone coming over? Everyone is coming over! Where are they? I don't see them. Okay, well, we'll see them in a bit. He needs to build up his friendship with um, Caden and Ebony. And if they don't show up, he'll invite them over to their place a little later in the day. Who are you? Oliana Nagari. Oh, Oliana, it's nice to meet you. I'm glad you're the lifeguard. Because we have seven exhausted children that want to swim. Nice to meet you, Oliana. Oh, oh, it's New Year's Eve. Yay, they're spending it at the beach. They're all celebrating. That's great. Okay. Oh, is everybody asleep? Candy's here. She's uncomfortable. She's tired. Well, you can, uh, you can sleep on this after you eat. There. You can nap there. That works. Oh, everybody's celebrating. Oh, she looks pregnant. Oh, that's probably wrong to say. She might not be. Okay, all the kids are asleep. This is not very exciting. Okay. Zane. None of your friends came over. That's disappointing. Unless, well, let's zip out a little bit. No, I'm not seeing them, unless they went to the bar. Okay, so Zane, uh, the kids are all sleeping, so what I want you to do is... No, you're not going to nap. You're actually going to go for a swim. Uh, swim. You're tense, but that's okay. You're a little tired, but that'll be okay. Okay, Gulliver. Oh, you got your sleep up. That's great. Gulliver's doing amazing. Okay, is there something here? Oh, how is your intelligence skill? Mental too. Here. You know what? Play with... Um, let's see, who probably... Who else needs intelligence? Probably Roxana. Sure. Run inside. No. Now everyone's uncomfortable because it's raining. That's fine. Okay, Carly, you're not going swimming. You're going to go ask for advice from Zane. Okay, ask advice. Zane I wanted him to, like, swim some laps. I mean, it's just raining. A missing toy. I was thinking about one of my favorite toys and can't find it. I'm starting to miss it and feel sad. Keep looking for it or play with a different toy. Keep looking for it. If it's your favorite, go and find it. I don't think you're going to find it here, but um, you might. Oh, Zane, you're getting so fat. Zane, you're tense. Can you not? Here, swim around. Carly, I don't want you in the water because you are exhausted. So here, go take a nap. There you go. Nap over there. Oh, good, they're playing chess, which is great. These two are celebrating New Year's. Whoa, now it's a thunderstorm. Now someone could get struck by lightning. I don't like this. It's two in the afternoon. They're going to have to take the, the... They're going to have to head home. They are just going to have to head home. Okay, getting in line to use the washroom. That's fine. Okay, I'm just going to keep an eye on everybody. Actually, I'm just going to start sending them home on their own. Zane will follow in a few minutes. Okay, so that was disappointing because it was a rainy day. But, uh, and as per usual, we're missing children. Yeah, we can't uh, go anywhere without uh, losing some children. But they're all back. So now, Zane is tired. I want him to get a little bit of sleep. Um, and then we're going to look at the kids here. Bill? Bill is fine. And Bill was such a good 
die in the last part, he gets to go play on this thing. Bill being good is relative. I was just impressed he was able to steal stuff from his kleptomaniac trait. But it's a win, so good job. Uh, he's going to play Space Explorer, and Yvonne was so good, she, well, she'll get her bath and then she can go play. Take a bath. I don't know who you are. Are you Gulliver? No, nope, Gulliver. Sorry, you're not in as bad a state. But you were pretty good yesterday, too, so you can play Space Explorer as well. Vaughn is taking her bath, and the other ones are going to start working on their school projects or chores. Um, so, Carly is... Okay, she's working on a skill. That's good. Roxana is going to sleep. You know what, I'm okay with that. Tammy is returning to Lot, so she's not back yet. Sean, he wants to do the jungle gym as well. Okay, Tammy, where are you? Okay, you're on your way back. You're exhausted. Okay, we're going to let everybody sleep a little bit. It's only 5 o'clock, but there is food. We're going to keep things going. We're just going to keep things going. Okay, is anybody playing Space Explorer? Bill is. Bill's the only one who's in a good enough state to go and play in the park. Well, good for him. Good for him. Some skill is going up here. I think it's his creativity. Wow. He is probably still a C student. Yeah. Okay, so he's having a blast. Gulliver, I would love Gulliver to come play, but apparently he wants to have this piece of toast. Uh, well, everyone's sleeping. Everyone is sleeping. This is, uh, oh, Sean reached level three of the motor skill. So just as a reminder, we're trying to hit the four skills that children have to level three. So once they hit that, they should work on another one. Oh, you can go take a bath then. That's great. How are Sean's skills going? Two, two, three, three. He's getting there. So these, some of these kids need to start up their school projects. They want to age up. Okay, um, I'm going to let you keep playing. Keep playing, Bill. Um, oh, Carly, what's up with you? You were just watching TV. You're exhausted. But if you're not going to do anything, I'm going to get you cleaning up a little bit. Yeah, Reba. All right, Zane is awake. He needs a bath. Oh, there's just no way to take a bath. Carly does not want to sleep, so I'm going to get her working on... Oh, she doesn't have a school project. Yep, so you know what? You can start your homework. Zane has to help a kid. Gulliver, you were doing fine. So you know what? You, I want you to go play Space Explorer for a bit. Bill's just about done that, I think. And then, who's yelling? Oh, yeah, it's the little concession stand over here. All right, we got things going. Okay, Zane, hop in the bath while you can. Because now we're reduced to a uh, single bathtub. Nothing's been cleaned. And then you got to help somebody with your homework. Call Caden and Ebony over. Or maybe just Ebony. Maybe just Ebony. Because you know what? The kids will go to bed at some point. Okay, so Zane is helping Carly with her homework. That's the one thing to help somebody with that he has done today. He got hot dogs and fruit salad in the fridge. Um, he didn't get to start his job yet, but he's going to call Ebony over because I think he's in an okay spot to start rebuilding this relationship with Ebony. It's, Looks like Bama. Too, it's been too tough. Hey, we'll keep an eye on the kids. Oh, Yvonne, you deserve some playtime. Ebony's coming over. Play Space Explorer. Bill, how are you doing? Oh, that's not Bill. Where's Bill? Bill! Okay, Bill needs to run to the washroom. Ebony's here, Ebony's here. Okay, so the focus is going to be on Zane and Ebony. You need to build your relationship back up with her because she's put up with a lot with this new venture of yours of taking care of seven children, and she's missed you. So don't look so excited. 
Chumcha Hino. Okay. Well, you are more well, than a girlfriend. Let's flirt. It's New Year's. Yep, love, Ebony looks sad. Oh, she's fine, though. How are the kids doing? Orange? All right. Keep an eye on the orange ones. Oh, she's going to bed. You are playing Space Explorer, but you need to use the washroom. You know what? There's no one using it here. Oh, he just blew her a kiss. All right, Zane. Let's get the romance up. Make a move. Uh, no. Uh, throw New Year's Eve confetti with Ebony. Brighten her day. Come on, Zane. It's a lot of hard work. Um, get to know. Okay, all the kids are screeching in the background. Oh, oh no, 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 not asked on a date. Okay, he's just ignoring the children. He's like, I need to have some alone time with my girlfriend because it's been like months. Oh, yeah, the friendship and romance is going up. Okay, I will. How can there be monsters under the bed? It's only 9.30. Uh-oh, something got awkward there between the two of them. I don't know why. Kiss. All right. Something went off there for some reason. Ooh, there we go, Zane. Way to go, buddy. But now it's back. Kiss her again. Whisper seductively. Okay, it's awkward with all these children around, but he's gotta have some alone time. Kids, give Zane a break. Oh, flirt again. Oh, try for a baby. No, 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 no. There's enough children here. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. Dag, dag. Uh, woo-hoo. There you go. Kids, Zane will be back with you in about five minutes. Okay. Inappropriate. But I think Zane and Ebony needed some time together because it's been a while. All right. We don't need to see that. Zane just needs some alone time. Hopefully the children don't, like, run, come in on them. Ooh, we should lock the door. Maybe we just quickly lock the door for everyone. Everyone but Zane. I have to remember to unlock it or else Ebony would be trapped in there. Okay, Tammy. I know you're screaming because there's a monster under the bed, but can you still sleep? No. So if you can't sleep, take a bath. Take a bath. Carly, you're just standing there waiting for Zane, but you know what? Here, can you nap on the couch? There you go. Problem solved. Roxana, you need to use the washer. Oh, you need everything. Uh, why don't we get you some food first? Yeah, you're panicking, but you know what? Eat away your panic. Just eat it away. There is a lovely fruit salad for you. Bill, what's going on? Okay. Oh. All right. Ebony is back. Everything's right again. Okay. Zane, oh, she can't get out, right? <laughs> so don't forget to unlock the door. <laughs> also, Ebony's going to be stuck. I noticed out of the corner of the uh, video that uh, when they finished woohooing, fireworks went off, and now Zane has gone and collapsed on a bench. Yeah. Okay, the children are just making a mess. Um, can the children ask her something? Oh, can they ask her to spray the monster under the bed? Oh, oh, she doesn't really know her. Okay, give her a friendly introduction. Actually, no. Obviously, you have to run to the washroom. All right. Come on, Tammy. Let's take care of it. We don't need glitches right now. 
Okay, it's 11.30 in the evening. Zane is having a quick little nap. Then, if he starts a side job, I'll be very happy with the way the day went. Um, oh, it's New Year's. That's what's going on. Oh, is this going to go on for like 25 minutes? Okay, well, maybe Zane can uh, quickly catch up on some sleep. He's hungry, too. Actually, I'm just going to send him right to bed. Instead of napping on the bench. Tammy, can you go to bed now? No, nope, they're still uncomfortable. Oh, because there's still a monster under the bed. This is really getting annoying. And we have an angry ghost, Cassie. Cassie, you haven't left this worldly realm yet. Really? And Zane's going to be woken up. Okay, these monsters under the bed are making it very difficult. Very difficult to get anywhere. Okay, Roxana, run to the washroom. Gulliver. Okay, don't chat with Roxana. Roxana. Gulliver, get out of the way. Okay, Zane is exhausted. Ebony's leaving. I don't blame her. I would not stay here. This place is becoming a disaster real quick. Okay, there's got to be a child who can clean here. Um, let's see. Okay, Sean's asleep. Bill, Bill, you look like you're in a good spot. You're a little hungry, but here, why don't you clean this up? And then, oh, you're talking to Cassie, though. Actually, okay, you know, keep Cassie occupied. Maybe she won't break anything. I don't think there's much left to break. Zane's going back to bed. Yeah, he needs it. Tammy, you still will? Oh, you can sleep. Good, go to sleep. Roxana, oh, you're feeling energized. Here, why don't you clean? Yvonne is still out here playing. Oops, we kind of forgot about her. <laughs> oh, good for you, girl, but uh, you can go to bed now. Out playing at a park at 1 o'clock in the morning. Oh no, they're breaking the toilet. That is not going to work. Okay, who's not doing anything? Gulliver. Gulliver is happy. You know what? Do you have a school project yet? This is the thing that was in Gulliver's inventory. A wisp. I have no idea what this is. Element, void, power level one, play through the core three. I'm going to just place it somewhere. I'm not entirely sure what it is. Oh, and he also has that toy too. Um, okay, he doesn't have a school project yet, but maybe he can do his homework while he's fine. Get a little bit ahead. Why not? Okay, these two are eating. Oh, Roxana is panicking again. She's exhausted. Oh, Tammy is talking to Gavin. Gavin's over. Cassie's destroying everything. Wow, Yvonne. Oh, Yvonne needs to use the washroom. Okay, Zane. I know you want to sleep, but we need to fix. We need to fix the toilet. There's, there's no, no way about it. And then you need to fix the bathtub. We're gonna have some accidents. We're going to have some accidents. Uh, Yvonne, can you sleep? Can you sleep at least? No, too scared. Take a nap then. Oh! <gasps> Gavin is spraying the monster under the bed. Oh my god, a ghost is being useful. <gasps> That's amazing. That's amazing. Ghost one, monster under the bed, zero. Oh. You are a lifesaver, Gavin. You can stay. Cassie can go, though. It's only 2 o'clock in the morning. She can still destroy a ton of things. And she's just, like, glowing red. Someone, Bill, why don't you chat with her? Give her a friendly introduction. Did that say belittle anger? No. Let's, let's... Bill is in a fine state, so does Bill have a school project yet? No. But let's uh, let's um, let's get let's keep her busy with conversation. Ask about her day. Try to calm down. Come on, Bill. Um, um, talk about you. Give her a heartfelt compliment. I just noticed Bill has been in his bathing suit all day. The beach was a little while ago now. Zane, what are you doing now? Why are you looking at the art? You know what? Here, clean this. And then, uh, oh god, you're in a bad state. 
You clean it, you repair this. No one else is using the washroom right now. The washroom is out of order. Oh, Gavin, please just take food out of the fridge. Don't destroy the fridge, please. Please. Oh, Cassie's at least going outside. Okay, Bill, since you are still... Oh, you're getting tired. Did you do your homework? Do your homework. Someone just passed out. I heard the music. So I am playing this a little long to the evening because it's quite the disaster. You're telling Zane to leave? Okay, Glover's taking a bath. Zane, here, repair this. Oh, you can only replace it. Oh, no, it's not on Zane. Here, repair that. Uh, and then I'll let you go to bed. Uh, oh, it's Carly who passed out. Carly, why don't you try to go to bed now? Everyone else seems to be able to. There you go. All right, I think we're actually in a good spot. And it looks like we're getting some more help from Gavin. I see him taking out the garbage. <laughs> He's welcome. Any night. I think this is where I'm going to, to leave it off. I can play, uh, obviously, ahead till the morning because it's 3 o'clock Sunday morning. I'm not sure how much we got accomplished in this part. <laughs> but, um, you know, it, it, it's getting there. Uh, they are skilling up. I think Yvonne is still the head runner. She's got all of her skills. Uh, I'm just going to check on a couple of other. Bill was doing well on skills. Oh, no, he's not. It was uh, Gulliver or Sean? Gulliver. He's okay. Someone's getting close. Someone else is getting close out in all three. I don't think it was Tammy. Oh, they're all sort of progressing. Roxana wasn't even close. Okay, so I think here's where I'm going to leave it. Um, yeah, because Zane keeps repairing things and keep breaking, so I think he can go to bed now. Uh, and he'll just fix whatever's broken in the morning. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for watching. I'm still having so much fun with uh, this uh, gameplay. It's... Uh, Getting uh, interesting, to say the least. Um, oh, yeah, and Zane, before I sign off, I did put in, um, in case of emergencies, I put in this uh, bathroom bush. So, um, yeah, it's already being used because I got rid of one of the washrooms. I didn't really want to build another washroom, but obviously, uh, yeah, there's going to be a lineup to use the bush. <laughs> It's not a cheat. It's a little bit of a bend in the rule. Anyway, thanks everybody for watching. Really appreciate it. Peace and love.